brush, some Too Faced, a brand for my face. Tomorrow, a hairbrush, new shoes, and a case. I asked to my reflection, let's get out of this place. Past the church and the steeple, the laundry up the hill, buildings and the billboards, memories of it still keep calling and calling, but forget it all, I know I will. Tempted by the fruit of another Tempted but the truth is discovered What's been going on Now that you have gone There's no other Tempted by the fruit of another Tempted, but the truth is discovered. Good morning. It's the Monday morning cup of coffee. I'm your host, Tommy Womack. How you doing? Had a fantastic gig in Cave City this past Friday night at the front porch. The whole band was there with me, John Jackson, Lisa Oliver Gray, Dan Seymour, and Nathan Womack, my son, played drums and acquitted himself marvelously. Got a gig coming up Monday, tonight, uh, at The Local. 110 28th Avenue North. Uh, show starts at 7, I believe, and it's the Tommy Womack Crime Family with special guests Andrew X Adkins and the True Hearts, which are both acts worthy of your seeing. I, I uh, tell you that for sure. I want to tell you about something about a show a little earlier than usually I say. Friday, July 27th, I will be at the Red Clay Music Foundry in Duluth, Georgia. That's 3116 Main Street, Duluth, Georgia, Friday the 27th. And the Red Clay Music Foundry is a great musical theater in Eddie... Eddie Owen that runs it used to run Eddie's Attic in Decatur. And it's a great venue. Uh, and please get the word out. Help me to get the word out. It's a rather large theater. So I, I would like to play for some people, if possible. Uh, Friday, August 10th, I'm going to be at the Southgate Revival uh, in uh, Newport, Kentucky, 111 East 6th Street. And I really hope I can get a street team together, too, to get some people out to that show because it's, it's just me. Daddy Duo played there about a month ago and did great. But, you know, that's Will Kimbrough's drawing power along with mine. Just being me this time, if you're in the Cincinnati, northern Kentucky area, uh, I, I would love it for you to come out. I am very excited. I'm still looking at the last edit, edits of my book. Uh, the book's title is Dust Bunnies. Yes, that's right, Dust Bunnies. And I'm looking to get it out as soon as possible. I don't have the patience for, to get a book deal for waiting around for that. So I'm going to self-publish. And um, I don't know exactly how I'm going to come up with the money. I want to do something maybe a little covert than an out-in-the-open GoFundMe. Uh, I have a feeling God will provide. I'm really excited by the book. I'm having doing to do the edits. I'm having to read the book again. And I'm pretty satisfied with it so far. I've got the typesetter arranged, the proofreader arranged. It's already been professionally edited. I have the cover art uh, on the way. And, uh, and it's very exciting. I'm going to have a new book out. I don't know when I'll get it out. I'll get it out when I uh, get enough money to do so. And I am reluctant to do a GoFundMe because I've gone to the well that you know so many times doing that anyway god bless you don't let the bastards get you down hope you have a good week
Have a good one.